last of the cowboys, the giddy up gone boys. Eighteen wheels on the concrete, it's a slow and dying breed. Rolling like Jesse James, a modern day outlaw game. If you're out here riding with me, come on back and make some noise. We're the last of the cowboys. Alright guys, we're on our way to uh, Spencer's place at the moment. So we are going to go there right now, and we are actually going to go pick some, I think uh, we're just going to handle a little bit today, I believe. So yeah, I'll be I'll be back when we uh, get there. Breaker, man, truck's yeah. filthy, but I like it. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, no problem, mate. I really like your Ram, man. Yeah. Cool, cool. Yeah. I almost thought it was GMC rolling in from where it was so dirty, I couldn't even tell. Yeah. They kind of uh, do match, though. They kind of do a little bit. Not a lot, but... Yeah, no, for sure. I mean, they're both dealies. They, they kind of... The badging is almost similar. Like, from super... Yeah. Um, yeah. Super far away. And, like, the the bumper and everything and the, the grill. Yeah, let me turn her off. That's it. Kind of close. So, all right, the plan is I already filled in a bolt, but we're going to go buy some jet skis in a boat, and uh, I'm getting one for you, one for bolt, and then we're going to have the boat. So, we'll go boating here. Not right now, because the weather isn't good, but yep. maybe later. All right. Is that exciting? Oh, yeah. You ever think you were going to do that on a farm? Go boating? Go jet skiing? No. No, no. Not Maybe right. four-wheeler in or, like, dirt biking, but all I'm right. Done as a kid, but I haven't done on a farm, really, but yeah. Okay. Well, good thing you brought your truck. I'll have you two pull, uh, pull the jet skis, and then I'll pull the... It's a, it's a fifth-wheel um, trailer on a big boat, so... Okay. All right. Good truck and pull it. I, I don't know yeah. if we can pull it. If not, we'll have to have you in the King Ranch pull it. We'll see. Yeah. Try it high small. I know it is kind of small. We're going to push it to its limits, man. All right, guys. That was pretty fun. Make fun of me and my Dodge Ram. But, yeah, we're going to get to Outlaw Motorsports with Recon, and we are going to go pick up our new jet skis and a boat that Spencer TV has mentioned. So, yeah. We, uh, well, I called the other night about your uh, deal you're running on the, on the skis and the boat on the 50-footer. And I'm coming down here, you know, just check it out. What can you tell me about it? Um... The jet skis over here. Um, yep. So they're actually uh, jet propelled. They. Um... I would hope so. They're jet skis, right? <laughs> there we go. So they. They are actually on a spring-loaded trailer. So basically, um, what whenever you hit the, whenever you're coming up into the trailer. Yep. It's it you hit springs on the pads versus just hitting metal. You know okay, I mean? so it's a little different. It's not. It's just softer coming in, easier yeah. for yeah. maybe a novice rider. But that's nice. Yeah, I, I I know quite a bit about these. They're um they're both brand new. They have no miles on them. Um, for no hours. Yep, these just came in from the shop actually. And then okay here, so I know, and then the trailer is just one axle, typical, typical. So they're sea Do you guys like the sea dews? Breaker bolt. What do you guys think of them? Yeah, can I sit on him for a minute? Yeah, jump on, man. He's got jump horns. For sure. Does this have that? a horn? Does it have a horn? Uh, I guess. Oh. Oh, what is that? Is that custom? You put that in? Maybe. Ooh. Maybe. I like Ooh. that. I like that. That's kind of cool. You know, we're pulling in up at the dock. You know, all the girls are there. The the dock girls, you know, helping us dock. And then you yep. you lay on the horn like that. You know. Press them. That's good. I like it. Bolt, you like it? I like the orange. Orange and the yeah. white. So you were asking it's clean. You were asking about the bolt or boat too, right? I was asking about if I could get it as like a combo package deal kinda. Bundle it all together, two skis and a boat. Alright. You know what uh, I'm saying? Have you checked out the boat yet? Not only online. Only online, so uh, let's go take a peek at it Oops, then. What do you say? There's a fence. Yeah, yeah. It looks really good. How long is it again? It is forty foot. Forty foot? You sure? Looks a bit bigger than 40 foot. I don't know. 40 foot. It's a 40 foot boat. Isn't the trailer 40 feet? Yeah. Oh, yeah. True. This PJ trailer is 40 feet. You're right. Yeah. Well, isn't it? Is it almost classified a yacht or is it still just a. It, it, is, te it is technically a, considered a yacht. Okay. I mean, like legal or I don't really know how like all the laws work but i'm sure i'll figure it out then it looks like there's a bathroom better how many bedrooms are downstairs it looks like there's uh some uh, just a single holes. bed single bath stuff like that and okay you single prop too single prop gotcha 
This is pretty clean. I've done a bit of research on it, but I one thing I like about it is the trailer. It seems pretty pretty nifty. Now this this will be quite a bit for us to pull. What's do you have the weight on this? Including the trailer, I, including kind of everything all loaded together. I would have to pull up the weight. I don't know that off the top of my head. Um, okay. But it's all on the computer. Okay. I don't know if my truck can pull it. That would be pretty crazy. It, it's probably pushing the limits. Could you actually go find that out? Yep. Okay. Let me go run into my office and find that out quick. Yep. All right, guys. So what are you thinking while he's gone? Mm. Um. That's boat. Nice. Thing about that too. Yeah. Yeah. No, the boat is pretty expensive. Now, <clears throat> the thing about this is, I'm hoping to almost get the jet skis for free. Yeah, now, totally. when I package this up, I'm, I'm gonna price it to where I have the value of the boat in my head, and maybe get two grand off three. But then I, 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 I want to get such a deal that we're literally like not paying for the jet skis. Yeah. So maybe this good cop, bad cop will come in soon. Yeah. So you guys, you guys just kind of, I'm going to be talking about the price and then break. You're just like, no, man, that's how are you going to pay me? You know, you act like you're the intern, act like I'm struggling paying for you. Act like you just don't want this to be done. And yeah. then, yeah, we'll kind of see how that plays out. But let's wait yeah. for him to get back. 16,250 pounds. All right. That should be doable. We'll, we'll see how it pulls through. But one thing I want to do is test. Can I test pull it? Like not right now, but, um, like later, just before I walk away with that, I would like to hook it up. My, you know, that's super important for me. I don't want to buy a new truck to pull a boat. So, mm -hmm. um, and then I, I think I like it all. I've, I've looked online a bunch. I've done a lot of thinking, a lot of nights staying up late. So, um, what, what's your price tag you got on this again? What are you offering? Now, if I threw both the jet skis in and the boat. Everything included, trailers, little the jet ski so trailers too. The jet skis retail yep. alone is about nine grand a piece. Okay. On those. So you're looking at got right there is going to be about ninety eight, um, not including tax. Okay. So kind of sitting around, or no, sorry, like one twenty total, no tax yet. Take take. Okay. Could I? Could we do something where? You know, I see the package deal and stuff, and I see the boat. Have you had many sales on the ski dues? Uh, or the, sorry, the sea dues? Uh, actually, being on the West Coast, we actually fly through, and we have to keep restocking them. Gotcha. Okay. Well, um, could I offer you 100 Or could I do 95 for the boat, everything, the jet skis? Obviously, that's not tax and stuff, but I, I have the cash right now. 95 k for the two sea sea dues uh, in the boat. Can you do 110? Could I do a hundred? Hundred even. That's a clean number. Your accountant will like it. How about straight cash? We'll meet in half. We'll meet halfway, 105. Uh let me talk to Breaker. What do you think about that? Mm -mm. A little bit too high. A little bit too high. Too high? Uh all right, Recon. Right, how about uh what do you do uh hundred two point hundred two five? Hundred two thousand dollars. I'll do hundred and two five. Okay. All right, that works. Deal. All right. <clears throat> All right, let's go inside. Let's do some paperwork. I want to take these home today, boy. Which truck do you plan on pulling the truck with? Oh, uh, we were gonna do the GMC first, and then check, and then if not, we'll probably take the four fifty. Um, but you said sixteen thousand pounds, so that should be right around its limit. Well, it should um, be fine. What's the biggest truck you brought? Because that's realistically what you're going to need. <laughs> yeah, uh, I brought these three here. They're all about the same. They're all... <clears throat> I would say the 450 is probably the best for towing right now. Yeah. Um, yeah. I would agree that 450 should be able to pull that. Yeah. Okay. Let's go ahead and uh, let's get the paperwork done. And for? All right. Well, here's all my information, driver's license thing. All right. Go ahead run and run through it. Here is the bill of sale. I'm going to have yep. you sign here, 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 and here. Perfect. There you go. All righty. Now, make sure you get those insured. <laughs> yeah, no, for sure. I, I already have them. I, I'm i going to call my agent literally right now, and I can I already have all the paperwork filled out. So, cool, cool. All right. I'll just send them the VIN number and everything that's on the bill of sale and the titles for them. 
Perfect. All right. Cool. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Have a great day. Yeah, you too. Day. All right, Bolt. Are you up to it? I think we're going to need you to pull it. I think yeah. the 450 is the only thing that's going to be able to make her. Okay. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll help you back up to it. Yep. Okay. All right, so let's get him over here, Brecker. All right. Let's get him backed up. This is, uh, this is the oversized load. Yep. Oh, this isn't. Real quick, oh. you get him backed up. I'm going to see if he can go around the back way because it'll be a tight turn. All right. Keep coming. We're good. Keep coming. Stop. There you go. All right, so we ran around. You, Bolt, what you're going to do is just go as straight as possible, as close to that trailer as possible, and then loop around it and go all the way outside on the around the building and then shoot out that way. You got it? Okay. You nervous? <laughs> you should be. All right. No. I'm good. Don't rank this up. This is uh, this is isn't cheap boat. So just go straight, and we'll yeah. we'll guide you here. Yeah, I'm gonna pull out. Make sure I don't clip onto. Yeah. That's what I'm a little worried about. Just nice and yep. slow. Nice and slow. There you go. Start cranking it. Yep, he's good. You're clear. You're clear. Nice. Okay, that wasn't as bad. Nope. Keep thinking this boat is a lot longer than it is. It is long. All right. So nice and slow boat. We'll meet you around. All right, breaker. Let's grab the. Uh, Oh, that's not my truck. Here's my truck. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> let's grab the uh, let's grab the jet skis and we'll meet them. All right. Maybe have I'll go in front and then maybe you fall behind. All right. That way we kind of uh, we kind of almost kind of help them down there. Yeah. Go back here. Let's put her down. Do all that stuff. There we go. All right. So we'll we're gonna try and just cushion them here, make sure no traffic gets in the way. We'll take the back roads again, and then go to the farm. But there's the setup, guys. We have. Two new jet skis, a boat, bolt. I think he feels pretty comfortable in it. That was a. Uh, he swung pretty wide there. That was good. It didn't. I like the trailer. I think the trailer's really nice. It seems like he's pulling it. He is squatting a bit, but uh, we all just go nice and slow. I think the, the tr trailer weighs a lot more than what he said. Bolt, you think it weighs a lot more than he said? Yeah. Why it do you is. say that? I try squatting. It shouldn't be squatting it. Right yeah, it shouldn't be squatting that much. I think what he was doing and was saying it was less than it really was. Just because uh, we were worried about that, the weight of it. So I could see him doing that, but it looks cool from back here, man. It looks really cool. All right, guys. So we're going to head back down there now. I don't want to. Uh, you know, I, ha I just got insurance on him. I talked to that and gave him the serial, <coughs> the serial numbers and the VIN numbers on air. Not this year. The VIN numbers on it, so all this is uh, insured just in case. Like, what was the crash or the intern just took like a crazy turn? Um, but we won't be boating for, with these. Now it's not the season to go boating just yet, even though we're in California. It's uh, we we might take that out to the sea here soon. I think we have a little bit of farm work, a field work to get back to, but mostly today we'll be just buying the boat. Pretty crazy addition to the farm. Now a lot more family. Will down of course i think my turn's right here all right that was actually the wrong turn one more i should have remembered that the cornfield was on this side that i was past it but that's pretty bad of me honestly but i i typically don't try to take these back roads i typically stay on the interstate whenever we're doing stuff but for this i don't want that boat on the interstate that'd be crazy absolutely crazy so there we are i already need to power wash my gmc off but it would be fun to take it out here today but i I don't think we can. Maybe take out the jet skis just to toy around on a little bit. And then Breaker was joking. He's like, Spencer, why can't we take them in the like irrigation system here? But that would, that would be kind of cool and funny, but I don't want to damage them on the... It's like full concrete, so if you were to just veer off course just to the left a bit. Now, I, I bet you could. I bet you could. If you could just maintain straight, uh, just perfectly straight, it seems like the, the jet skis would fit in there. But last thing I would want is to to scratch them up, getting them in or out. Even though they will get scratched up, I just don't want to do it for that reason, and they could. I feel like if you just went to the right of it, and then you were concrete, you could really... Now, as we're driving down, I was thinking, and, and I've been thinking about this purchase, where we're going to park it. I'll probably keep it inside or... I will keep it inside or shed. On, inside or shed. But I'm trying to figure out where, uh, especially with all our equipment. I'll try and keep it in the back for now. There's a neighbor taking a forward harvester. Can I clear the, the entrance? 
Uh, I don't know if you're going to be able to clear it here. Let me, uh, ooh. We might have to call. go through the other way. Let's see. Get close. Yeah, you might have to go through the other way. Just kind of eye it up and I'll kind of, I think you're going to be close. Uh, Swing wide. You're good. He's good. All right. That, yeah. That antenna is Maybe the antenna. Hopefully that's flexible. Yeah, I went through some trees, but. There you go. A few branches won't hurt it. Stay stay on the, maybe like the right side more. I think you'll be good though. Yeah, these dang branches. Trees, we need to trim these up here soon. I do like them, but a wind protection. It makes the farm look really, really nice, but it is kind of a pain when we're bringing in something big. All right, where do you guys think we should put the boat? I was thinking I in our nice shed. Okay, Bolt's doing an amazing job. Holy buckets. There you go, Bolt. Keep bringing it back, crank it. Crank it, crank it, crank it. Ooh, that's gonna be tight. All right, straight, straighten it out right there. If you just now adjust your wheel to keep it straight. Crank back the uh, other way. Oh, too much. Well, yeah, mother. All right, yeah. there you go. Straighten it out a bit. I'm sure you can see. All right, keep coming. Yep, yep. yep. Getting a little too close. <clears throat> there you go. Recorrect. Nice. Just perfect. Keep going back. Wow, he's doing good. <laughs> Uh, All right, jump. five feet and low. Good, stop. Good, 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 stop, good, good, stop. good, 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 good. There you go. Jeez, man. Wow. All right, that's good. Go ahead, detach. Clean as a whistle. There it is, guys. The boat's in. I'm gonna park the jet skis in here. And we'll get those loaded in. Looks good, breaker. All right. Nice job. Nice job. Nice job. There we go, boys. Everybody happy? Better be. I think it was a good buy. All right, guys. Oh, come on, Bolt. Come on, Bolt. So I'm going to park my truck over by Spencer's, and we're going to call it a day today because it was a short episode, but again, yeah. Thank you guys for watching today's episode. Uh, if you guys want to, in the comment section below, uh, comment some questions you guys have. I'm going to be doing the Q&A uh, on the January 9th, or I'm going to actually end the Q&A on my Discord server in the, in the comment section below, or my description, I should say. I'll be in that January 9th, but thank you for watching, guys. If you guys like this video, hit the like button. If you guys want to comment in the comment section below, uh, comment down there. And if you guys like my content and want to support me in any way, subscribe to me. It'll help me out a lot. It'll push me out to more people that like this kind of content. So, yeah, I'll see you guys later, and peace out.